What's going on everybody? We are on our sixth drunken quest, which is the infamous Ernest the Chicken quest. You know, and I was thinking, how did they deviate from Ernest the Chicken to like, you know, I don't know, these crazy, insane, impressive, like, serious quests, like how funny Ernest and goofy Ernest the Chicken is, and they're like, Nah, you're gonna do Morning's End Part 2 now. You know, no problem. Anyway, just a thought. Back to the main point, though. Let's go check out the sheet here. So we're at Ernest the Chicken. We're going to Romeo and Juliet next, which is going to yield us five. Five quest points. Wait, does Ernest the Chicken? I think it does. I think so. Or maybe Romeo and Juliet does. Anyways. <clears throat> So we're gonna uh, we're gonna knock this one out. I have done these five literally right before this, so I'm slightly inebriated. Um, it's not about the total yield; it's about how fast you drink it. And honestly, I'm kind of feeling like you, bro. Actually, hold on. Let's look at this. What? Are, oh my god, that's so sweet. I didn't realize that uh, <laughs> that you like. The animation was active during the uh, equip your character screen. And for a second there, I just thought, sorry, I was just looking at this. I thought I was getting bonuses from the Ale of the Gods, but it's actually from the Ale of the Glory. So anyway, uh, we'll get started with our quest here. Let's crack open our delicious, just yummy, oh my god, natural light. That's so good. By the way, since I've done like, you know, five quests before this, I'm feeling a little loosey-goosey, which is, you know, for better or for worse, I don't know, but here's the Natty Light. By the way, here are the beer cans. Yay. Um, well, let's do this. My dude, Slayer Music. Hi, and welcome to my quick guide of the Ernest the Chicken quest. Everything that is required and recommended is in the description and also on the screen for the next two seconds. Let's start the quest. Real quick, you'd think that it would taste better, like, after you've been drinking it for a while, but it really doesn't. The Natty Light is not very good. It's not very good. I talk to Veronica and select option one. Next, go north and enter the manor. Once you've entered the manor, party fouled go myself, upstairs spilled to the beer top floor. Dong. You can do this by opening the door north and go up the stairs. Whoops. Just west of the stairs, you'll find another smaller staircase. Climb up the stairs, and here you should find... Climb up the stairs, go west of the stairs, we'll find a smaller staircase. Let's do it. Find a chicken and Professor Adelstein. Talk to the professor and select option one. Okay, have you guys seen, there's like an enemy you can fight where you get sent to like another dimension. I don't know if it's like this portal machine. It's like a Slayer monster. Those things are the worst. They kick your ass. They're like one of the worst Slayer tests. Sorry, I just wanted to say that real quick. Afterwards, we will need to select option two. After you've spoken to him, let's go back to the middle floor. And then go east. Middle floor and Open east. that door and then just go south. Enter the southern room and then just go west. And enter the west. Okay. Oh, shoot. Western room. There I'll find some fish food. Take it from the floor and then just go back to the staircase to the... See, like, I like these quests because they're so, like, goofy and simple. You know, it's like... This quest, it's, in, it's incredible to think about, but I did this quest like 15 years ago, and I'm, I'm doing it again, you know. Magic in this game, it's, it's, it's so good. Main floor. On the main floor, just go northwest, and now we'll need to go to the most northwestern room, which is the kitchen. 
Inside the kitchen, open the southern door and they will find some poison in the corner. Next, go back and go to the most southwestern room. And on your way there, use the poison <coughs> on the fish food. Next, search the bookcase on the western wall to go to the paint. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh no, god, I gotta drink three drinks because I like, I messed up and I didn't even hear him. Shit, okay. Man. Sorry. Oh. Through it. Go down the ladder. And once you're in the basement, just next to you, there is lever B. Pull it, then go southwest. I always feel um, bad for the fish in this one. Because, like, you gotta, um, you just kill them. To the southern wall, they'll find oh. lever A. Pull it. Afterwards, go directly north, and they'll find a gap in the wall on your minimap. Oh, look at this. Hold on. We get ready for this. Doesn't look like it. Okay, that's fine. Wait, 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 ba, 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 ba. Don't tell me I messed this up again. Please, God. Oh my God, I did. Oh my God. Fuck. Son of a bitch. Yeah, so you, <clears throat> any smart person would not be drinking as much as I'm drinking today. Actually, just more specifically for this quest, but also today. So that's three. That's three drinks for messing up. Damn it. Okay, we're at one minute, 39 seconds. And... I'm like kind of actually you know what I think I should, probably should start doing is uh, putting these drinks into pouring them into like cups so that you can see like that I'm actually you know drinking from a clear cup <sighs> but anyway uh, yeah I mean I'm like almost done with this beer already and it's minute 39 and we've got 518 so this is gonna be a lot more than I thought honestly I was thinking it was only gonna be like you know beer and a half maybe two but we may we may bleed up to three especially if i keep fucking up let's continue no go through the door so good and then go north north of the table next to the crates there is lever d Pull it, and then just go back south and go through the same door you just came from. Next, pull lever A and B again. You guys remember when uh, Green After HQ was a thing? After you pull both levers back up, let's go to the northwestern corner and go through that door. I used to print uh, full quest guys Next, off. go through the western door, then the oh, northern door, so and here you'll find in this small room two more levers. Pull lever F and E. Next, go east. Twice. Next, go to the eastern wall and pull lever C. Then, go back through the same two gates back to the northwestern corner of the room. And here, you'll need to pull lever E on the northern wall. Next, what go back east hell? through Wait that same door. What? What's up? What's up here? What's the problem? Please don't tell me. Next, go south east through that same door and 
Let me get the oil can, dude. I don't know what to say. Um, I fucked this one up. And I'm going to be hurting tomorrow. Let me put this, let me put it to you that way. Also, sorry, I was kind of far away from my mic, so hopefully you can hear me. At least you can see my face. We have to just start from the legit beginning. Oh, my God. And I got to finish this beer because... Oh. Let's just crack open another one. There it is. Boom. <sighs> Shit. Okay. Well, we're going to go back. Actually, maybe if I go up here, it'll reset them. I don't know how that works. Hopefully it does. Okay. Focus. Oh, my. Fucking do a. I had to take a stamina pie for that. Never. Oh, you know what? That's probably what it is. Did I forget to do that? Maybe? I don't know. Gotta look back at the footage. Shit. A and B. B. Drink the stamina pot. Okay, go through here. Yeah, definitely didn't pull both. It's got. Uh, I keep telling myself that you know you. You guys are probably watching and think I'm a total idiot. Jeez, Louise. Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. Point B. Okay. Sorry. So we're here. We're getting the oil can. Okay. Dude, what the? That thing is huge. That thing is absolutely massive. Jeez, that's the biggest oil can ever. Actually, maybe it's not. It just looked huge on the ground. Let's go back to okay, the back surface. to the surface. To the main floor. Climb up okay. the ladder. Or at least try to. I feel you, bro. And then just exit this room by pulling the final lever on the eastern wall. Next, let's go east and go to the most southeastern room of this manor. This is next to the dungeon sign. Once you've entered this room, go a bit north to the northwestern corner and behind the crates there you'll find a spade. Be sure to pick this up and then just go through the door north. No. Continue running north and run around oh anti-clockwise around the manor oh. until you... Spade. We gotta grab the spade. Spade, spade, spade. Ooh, there's a shear there. It's a spade. And we gotta run <coughs> through this door. Also, I feel like I'm talking like this. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I recommend that you, if you get to this part, that you just start from when I was doing... The first quest, which was, I'm already forgetting, damn, Cook's Assistant. If you start at Cook's Assistant and just watch from here, you'll see the progression of me drinking and drinking and drinking, and it's not very good. Bad, bad, very bad. Anyway. You see a compost heap on the western side. A compost heap? 
I love Slayer music. He's the freaking. He's so good. Use your spade on the compass heap and you'll find a key. After you've gotten this key, let's go south and go to the southwestern corner. Use your poisoned fish food on the fountain and wait until you get three messages in your Yeah, this is what I was talking you about earlier. You die killed the fish on the and surface. Like, Bro, come you'll on talk now. to yourself and get the pressure cog. After you've gotten this, let's enter the oh. manor once again. Wait a minute. Okay, there it is. Okay, I want to actually show you guys something that I didn't know about, but I figured out earlier, and it was, like, legit killing me. I was, like, dying. I don't know if it's going to happen right now, but if I run over here, there's, like, something that, like, is over here that attacks you. Yeah, look. Oh, no, 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 that's not it. It's, like, a, um, there, right there. Dude, what is that? Look. When did that happen? Was that, has that been here forever? It's fucking me up, too. Look, I... I could legit see in some hardcores getting... No, 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 no. Oh. Oh. Oh, my God. See? That's what I'm saying. Did you see that? I just got hit by a, a freaking three. Like, I just ran over there. What the fuck was that? Oh, my God. Okay. Sorry. I was nervous. All I've got are these two important, you know, these two things. But the, the problem is that if I die, I, I got to chug a beer. So <laughs> that would not work out very well for me right now. Let's keep going. Once we are back inside, let's go north of the staircase and there will find a small room with a skeleton and a rubber tube. Quickly grab the rubber tube and get out of there. Since oh, we have all oh, three items, oh, let's return oh, to Professor Ardenstein to complete oh. our quest. Oh. Fuck. What the f fucking hell? Dude, I... Oh my god. I had four health. He would have... That 22 would have one shot me. Made me nervous. I'm telling you, dude, those vines, don't mess with them. They will kill your ass. Ernest. Oh, it's four. What? No, 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 okay, thanks, bye. Also, I hate this ad. Anyway, yeah, um, four quest points. I thought it was five. Maybe Romeo and Juliet was five. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of. But anyways, we just knocked that shit out, man. I'm really happy. Um, that's six quests we've done today. And next one up is going to be Romeo and Juliet. So, as always... Thank you for watching. I cannot wait to start our sixth Drunken Quest, which is, of course, it's the seventh. It's actually the seventh Drunken Quest, because we just did the sixth. But thank you for watching the sixth Drunken Quest, and I hope that you join me next time for Romeo and Juliet.